Carl here from Games, Brains and Headbanging, live to GBHBall.com for short. And it's album review time as the Swedish rockers Normandy will release Dopamine on February 9th, 2024 via Easy Life Records. Uh, a drug album, as the band calls it, but not the drugs you're thinking of. Instead, focusing on our desire to be needed, wanted, to constantly consume stuff on the internet and elements surrounding that. It's big and thought-provoking stuff from Normandy, which certainly gives the album a lot more weight. Yet, even without this knowledge, the depth of feeling and their expressions are clear throughout, across the entirety of the record. Putting it simply, what Normandy have to say here matters. Alongside that, though, it's also an album of Normandy alternative modern rock anthems. They're back, and they're picking up pretty much where they left off, beginning things in a fashionable way with Overdrive. Now, that might be an odd word you're thinking I'm using there, but it's fashionable because it's all the rage to utilize effects and electronica these days, and this track exemplifies this reality. One hell of a catchy number, nonetheless. Which is par for the course with this entire album, of course, this is Normandy after all. The following serotonin and flowers for the grave is them through and through, combining rock groove, emphatic pop melodies, erratic electronica, and bring it all together in the choruses. Although when it comes to choruses that most will be singing for hours, days, and weeks afterwards, look no further than the brilliant Blood and the Water. I think it probably doesn't get more infectious than this, and there's a reason why this was a single uh, before this album was released. <laughs> Though fans of Normandy aren't going to be left wanting as the album goes on, and the band continues to deliver thoughtful messages and unforgettable music with the likes of Ritual, Butterflies, Colorblind, and Hourglass. The latter of which, which features Berry Tomorrow's Danny Winter Bates, an exciting guest vocalist, inclusion on a track that is one of the more layered and unique sounding tracks of all on the album. Fear not though, this album is totally rooted in modern rock and has an accessibility that will see listeners far and wide enjoying themselves here. When they're delivering emotive and honest tunes like Sorry, big bangers like All In My Head and undeniably infectious body movers like Glue. We missed you Normandy, welcome back and well done for producing another quality album. As I said, that is innately accessible. I'm not going to say it's for everyone. Uh, I like it a lot. I don't necessarily love it. Maybe a little too mad on the electronica for me overall, but I completely get the anthemic style of it. And so many of these tracks are so catchy. It's, they're very hard to get out of your head. I think that is what's going to be massively appealing to a lot of people. But not too long to wait for this one. You can hear it yourself. Dopamine by Normandy out on February 9th, 2024 via Easy Life Records. You got any thoughts you want to share? Let me know in the comments. Thank you very much for watching. If you'd like to see more content like this, please consider hitting the subscribe button. It is gratefully appreciated. You can find us over at gbhbl.com, our full website, where reviews, news, and so much more goes up daily. We're also on all social media platforms, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, threads, at GBHBL. Just search for GBHBL and you will find us out there. We also have merchandise on sale. You can access the shop via the website.